What it do, what it do, what it do, what it do, what it do. Back at you with another one. So, NBA kicked off last night. I don't know about y'all, but I couldn't wait. You know what I mean? So, I don't know what, what was going on, but <clears throat> Boston and Tatum was on one last night. Like, Tatum was on one, but it was like his team was right there with him, though. It wasn't like he was just going off. It was like they was going off. You feel me? And I don't, I don't, Tatum was playing like he had a fire lit under him. Like he had, the, you know, the sparklies from the video game. Like that's how he was playing. Like he was giving three ball mid-range right game. Like goodness gracious. Like... He was out there proving something like, look here, bro. Last year wasn't no fluke. We right back at it again. You know what I'm saying? We gonna we 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 still smell blood. We didn't get we not comfortable. We not satisfied. We going right back trying to repeat that thing. You know what I'm saying? I don't I don't it looked like his jumper was like a little smoother than it than it was last year, right? Like like last year's like he kind of set it and shot it. You know what I'm saying? That that thing like it was just pow, that thing was just gone. Like that three ball just looked a little smoother. You know what I'm saying? I don't know. And, and I don't remember his three ball being that wet. Like that thing was he was he was yeah. Yeah, if it, if it's gonna be like that this year, it's a problem. Like I mean, he had, what, 25 at the half, but like a saucy 25, though, like, like a 25, like, ooh, ooh, like that 25. Like, not that he didn't have a sneaky 25, he had a, yeah, 25 at the half. You know what I'm saying? Like, they had them boys down, what, a, like a 20 ball in, like, the end of the first. Like, they wasn't playing. You know what I'm saying? Like... Now, I don't know if it's like a combination of like we trying to defend the, sh the chip and whatever happened in the Olympics, you know what I'm saying, with Steve Kerr benching him or whatever, like did we got like, you know what I'm saying, a little extra, did he, did he pull his Kobe and, and you know what I'm saying, his inner mamba and be like, I'm going to channel this and I'm going to let this frustration go all season. Cause that's how he came out open the night. Like he got something to prove. Like, like he feel disrespected. You know what I'm saying? Like I'm gonna show. I ain't gonna say nothing to the media. I ain't gonna get mad. <clears throat> nope. Y'all gonna see on this basketball court. Cause Tatum was out there playing like, like he had something on the line or something like. <laughs> Like, you know what I'm saying? Like, he, like it was winter go home or something. Like, bro, you out there going. I'm like, okay. If they whooped on New York like that and they ain't even had Porzingis, it's a problem. And it's like, they play better as a team this year. Like, that's what it's looking like. Like, they team unity. Is just gonna improve, right? Like that's like the beauty of sticking with the same team. You know what I'm saying? Because it ain't just about the talent on paper. It's about like look how many like second chance points they got, or like they pass up a good shot for a better shot. You know what I'm saying? Or you don't get the rebound, but you tip it to the guy that get it, they get the ball, and then he pass it to another guy, like. They got a lot of them type of buckets last night, right? Like, Drew Holiday a tip it, White to get it, then swing it to Tatum. You know what I'm saying? For a three. Or swing it to Brown. Like, they got so many, like, extra effort buckets. You know what I'm saying? And that's a big deal with New York, doing it against New York, because that's really their thing. Like, they the extra effort team. They was that last year. You know what I'm saying? So when you like out out effort the team when that's like they signature, yeah, you know I mean like that mean a lot. Normally that's hard that do all that eff extra effort type stuff. So you know what I'm saying? When you got a team that really play for each other without no ego, like that's dangerous. 
know what I'm saying? Like with them like getting that extra year of chemistry, of that brotherhood, of you know what I'm saying? Like and then they gonna extend Al Horford career because he ain't gotta do, you know what I'm saying? He he just out there OG and he ain't gotta do much for real. Like he, you know what I'm saying? Everybody can shoot though. Like, and I think the difference this year is that they make it because they're going to be a team that shoot volume threes, they're making an extra effort to crash the glass though, right? Like it ain't just somebody shooting, everybody just standing around. You know what I'm saying? Everybody crashing. So they getting them offensive rebounds. They getting them second chance points. And it's like, you can't get them two, three chances at a three. Like, like last year it was like, if they was off, <clears throat> they was off. Right? And they would kind of shoot themselves out the game. But how they came out this year is like, okay, we might miss the first one. But we a tall athletic team. So if we shoot, we, if we let that thing fly, but we gonna crash that glass, we gonna get a strong amount of offensive rebounds. Cause teams ain't prepared for it, right? Like, you know what I'm saying? You can't, you really can't coach against effort. You know what I'm saying? If everybody crashing the glass and they already a tall team. You know what I'm saying? They got <clears throat> legit, so everybody is the standard size of their position, if not taller. Like then that's without Porzingis last night. You know what I'm saying? So they get them extra effort buckets. And then you get, and then nine times out of ten, once you get the offensive rebound, somebody spot up for the three, they wide open. You know what I'm saying? They wide open. So yeah, that's that's crazy. I know one thing. Kerr might have pissed him off. And his whole team riding with him. That's dangerous. You know what I'm saying? I cannot wait for Boston to play Golden State this year. I mean, yeah, I cannot, well, I thought I said it wrong at first. I cannot wait for Boston to play Golden State this year. Oh my God, I think, <clears throat> I think Tatum gonna try to get him at least a 50 ball. I do. I think he gonna try to get him at least a 50 ball. Listen here, Wiggins, uh, uh, Kaminga, y'all better be ready. <laughs> Because Tatum is going at y'all neck when he see y'all. All that five, all that six, four guard stuff they like to do in Golden State. Good luck when y'all see Boston. Because I, I, I Tatum came out last night. He going to try to get y'all a 50. A mean 50, though. Like, not like a, you know, he might not be a play the game the right way 50. It's going to be a one, four, flat 50. Like, bop, 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 bop. 50. It ain't gonna be there. It ain't gonna be cutting and all that. Nope. It's gonna be give me that. Give me that. Bop, bop, bop type 50. You know what I'm saying? And then, and then the Knicks, like, I know they just put that together, but it didn't look good. <clears throat> it didn't. It was, ugh. I don't know. The Knicks look like a team that might be one of them teams that struggle to score enough points like that's what that's what they kind of look like you know what i'm saying like one of them teams that might struggle to score and because <clears throat> outside of outside of um brunson who they really got that's a bucket like that like you know a mikhail he good but he to me is a third guy like a second third type guy not like a consistent number two guy and then Cat don't play aggressive enough. Like, Cat really the most talented player on the team. But it's why they got rid of him in Minnesota, because he don't have that mentality. You know what I'm saying? Like, he's supposed to be averaging 25 and 15. You know what I'm saying? Like, he don't, he just don't impact the game enough for me. Like, he'll make a little play here, make a little play there, but it's just like, eh. And that be it. Like, so, I don't know. Uh, we gonna see how this Nick thing work, but you know, it's a tough, I mean, you did match up against the champ, so it's like, okay. But I didn't expect them to get whooped on like that. I expected to at least be a game. Like, 
they just got whooped on. Like, I, you know what I'm saying? Like, it was never even a game. Like, I, they was down like a dud in the first. So, yeah, I think, like, I think they going to miss um, uh, the guy they traded, not just Randall. I can't think of the guard name because they need a third scorer. They don't got enough scoring like that. I don't feel like they got enough scoring. They need more guys that can put the ball in the basket. You know what I'm saying? Like, Brunson just being ball dominant and just scoring by himself not going to be enough. Like, they're going to have to figure out a way where they're going to need pretty much 20 out of, they're going to need almost 30 out of Brunson, and they're going to need 20, 25-ish out of Cat and Mikhail. You know what I'm saying? Like, they're going to have to average that for them to be good enough. You know what I'm saying? Because everybody else is role players for real. Like, they role players. They solid role players. Like, they, if you get anywhere from 10 to 15 from them, you 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 more than happy. So, yeah, the niggas going to have to figure that out. Like, <clears throat> so, I'm saying I'm going to leave it at that. Like, comment, subscribe. <clears throat> see y'all on, on the next one. Peace.